This is Daniel Cook decorating eggs. Hi, I'm here with Don, and today he's going to teach me how to decorate eggs. Hi, Don. Hi, Daniel. This is Daniel Cook on a bike, in a plane, on a farm, playing games with many places and friendly faces. We'll have lots of fun with Daniel Cook. How do we get the yolk out of the egg? Okay, let me show you. What you're going to do is take just an ordinary push pin like they use on bulletin boards and see an egg has a narrow top and a wide top. Mm -hmm. Take the narrow one in your hand, hold it really, really firm. Like this? Like that. Take the push pin and you're just going to push it right in. Excellent! You got it. Okay, now take the push pin back out. Turn to the other end and do it again. Excellent. Now this time, wiggle it around a little bit. Try to get a bigger hole. No, nope, wiggle around the push pin like this. Ugh. Now to get even a bigger oh, hole... I cracked it! Did you? Okay, try another one. Now, the hole at the bottom needs to be a little bit bigger. I made these wires out of a coat hanger. Try mm -hmm. pushing that through, because that's a little bit bigger. Like Excellent. That? Now, go in there, squish it all around. That way the yolk and the white are mixed, and it'll be easier to blow out. Okay. Hey, I think we got it. Then for the fun, gross part, so the little hole that you made here, you put your lips over it. Like that? <laughs> you blow all the insides out. Cool, huh? Gross, but cool. This is tough. I need a bigger blow hole. Ah, excellent. You got the yellow. Keep going. Because we want to try a lot of different techniques of decorating eggs, let's blow out a whole bunch of these. Well, at least I can get it out easier. <laughs> it is yucky. I think now I got the hang of it. Yeah, it takes a little practice, doesn't it? <laughs> this is Daniel Cook dying eggs. Either chemical dyes, yeah, like that, which is food coloring. Or we could use natural colors too. So let's start with food coloring. Now, I think we should make a tool to dip the eggs in. Do you think that will hold an egg? Yeah, probably. Ah, uh, yellow. Good. Okay. It you looks like it do. might be yummy, but it's not. I'm gonna make my own tool. Okay. Without using any tools. Excellent. Hey, I made a U. Well, maybe that will work. Let's try that. Hey. Beautiful. It works. He just invented an egg dipping tool. Cool. How do you do natural dyeing? Well, natural dyeing refers to dyes that come from plants. Do you know what these are? Pickles. Yep. Pickled what? Beet. Pickled beets. So we tried dyeing an egg in beet juice. We'll get a spice called turmeric. How many eggs do we have colored so far? Mm. We have a red. A food yellow. Coloring, a yellow food coloring. A, a yellow. A yellow turmeric. A red. Beet juice. But we could use lots of other stuff to decorate as well. Should we look through my studios and see what we can find? Okay. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna make I'm a going snake. To make, you're gonna make a snake? Yeah. I think I'm gonna make a frog. Well, here's his tail. The egg will be his head. Oh, excellent idea. Might need just a tiny bit of a bigger hole. Okay. For his head, because he is an egg. Yes, that's true. I think my frogs are gonna have one yellow eye and one purple eye. Beautiful. 
and scary. I have an idea. Let's see how yeah. our dried eggs are doing. Okay. We forgot about them. I think this guy won. That's the beetroot red. Boy, it's a totally different color. Chemical might win. Beautiful. Chemical again. Oh, yeah, definitely. These are the ones we did with chemical and natural dye. And this is Don's frog. And this is my snake. Thank you so much, Don, for teaching me how to decorate eggs. You're welcome. I think it's the coolest craft in the world. Cool.